Hey, guess what? What? It is I, Rubex. <laughs> Hey guys, what is happening? My name is RipperX. Welcome to Diablo 3 Reaper of Souls. This is some content that I got last night. I am officially in the 50s now. I'm trying to hit 60, and again, hopefully I'll get uh, to hit level 70 here in the near future. Diablo 3 has really improved since its release. One of the big changes was Loot 2.0. Now, essentially, Loot 2.0 lowers the amount of drops you get, but the drops are more frequently usable for your class. Uh, that's a big thing. It's it's uh, already noticeable, in my opinion. Also, there's definitely changes to the Paragon levels. There's now unlimited Paragon levels. Now, some of the new features in Reaper of Souls uh, that's pretty cool is uh, the new class. There's a new class called the Crusader, which was inspired by the Paladin from Diablo 2. The Crusader is a holy warrior that fights in melee to medium range combat. Goat and Tofu, my two buddies, have both played Crusaders. They really like the Crusader. It's a pretty fun class to play. I might uh, be making a Crusader class down the road here, but I am enjoying my Ice Mage. My Ice Mage is uh, rocking and rolling. I finally got to the point where I have pretty much all ice spells, and a lot of my gear is class-specific towards ice, so I've been happy with uh, the stuff I'm getting. Uh, the drops have been really nice, and I've definitely noticed Loot 2.0. It's pretty awesome. Now, there's also something new in the game for endgame stuff. It's called Nephilim Rifts. Now, essentially, a Nephilim Rift is a 15 to 20 minute random dungeon to clear for loot. There's a lot of legendaries that apparently drop in this, and to be able to open a Nephilim Rift, I believe you have to get five fragments or five shards or something like that. Definitely notice a difference in Diablo 3, uh, Reaper Souls, as well as some of the new features. It's a lot more fun than, uh, than it was during the release. Release was not nearly as fun as it is now. They've really fixed okay. some stuff up. And again, the big feature uh, as well in the new Reaper Souls expansion is Adventure Mode. Adventure Mode is a game mode where essentially all the game's waypoints are unlocked and are presented as a map instead of a list. Now, players can access any waypoint at any time. There's bounties and there's quests uh, in this mode, and it's a great way to earn experience. It's something that I haven't really touched on yet. Uh, I do want to make a couple videos. Once I hit level 70, we're going to jump into adventure mode and maybe get some videos. But again, for the most part, having a lot of fun playing my Ice Mage, it's been, it's been a blast. Definitely worth the money for the expansion. I was kind of 50-50 on getting the expansion just because, you know, I wasn't super impressed with Diablo 3 when it first came out, but I gotta say I'm happy. You know, they definitely have uh, fixed the game up a, a lot, and it's it's a lot more fun. I, I'm enjoying it. I'm having a new experience with Diablo 3, and again, I've, I've always been a fan of Diablo. Diablo 1, Diablo 2 were amazing games, so for the most part, that is about uh, all I have to say here. I think uh, I'm just gonna shut my mouth, and uh, the rest of the video is just gonna be pure gameplay footage of uh, Act 5 in Diablo 3, Reaper of Souls. Oh, and by the way, there's some epic uh, boss fights coming up as well, if you guys are interested. If not, uh, whatever. My bags are full. I think my bags are full. One second. Oh, and uh, if you guys are still here uh, watching the video, uh, I forgot to mention the expansion really capitalized on uh, some of the darker elements. They're bringing it, uh, bringing it back, bringing it back uh, to uh, Diablo One, Diablo Two here, just in terms of all the levels seem more gothic. It's pretty cool. Still waiting. Kill that 
from whatever plane of existence it finds itself in. But mankind is born of angel and demon alike. Every mortal, save myself, has demonic essence as an intrinsic part of their being. Losing that will rip their body and soul apart. Well, I said I wasn't going to talk anymore and I lied. Uh, I just can't help it. This level's awesome. It's called the Ram. It's pretty cool. I dig it. I guess we're just ramming this door. Uh, I'm really curious to see what's going to be on the other side here. I have a feeling it's not going to be pretty, but um, take it with a grain of salt. See what happens. Hold your breath. The gates have been destroyed. Heck yes, that was awesome. Coolest level I've seen so far. Dig it. All right, next up here, Pandemonium Fortress. Oh geez. Okay, this spell right here, uh, it's called Archon, but uh, the original name for it was What's Up Now, Bitches? What's Up Now, Bitches? What's Up Now, Bitches? Okay, I lied. Archon was the one uh, spell on my hotbar that's not ice. Everything else is ice, though. I'm not trying to brag, but uh, I'm pretty unstoppable. Kicking ass here. In normal mode, of course. Uh, no one needs to know that, though. Just pretend it's hard. Time. 
I need healing. I must wait longer. So far, so good in Diablo 3 Reaper Souls. Having a blast playing. Uh, what do you guys think of Diablo 3? Let me know in the comments.